celebrated rally driver Ian Duncan will switch to his former car and his Sun Patrol pickup for the Guru Nanak rally tomorrow in Suswa that will see more than 70 drivers taking part. Elsewhere, elite runners triumphed at the Kebiringo 10-kilometer road in Kisi. Organizers of the 33rd edition of the KCB Guru Nanak rally have laid down a tough rally to bring back the memories of the safari rally of the yester years with drivers traversing fresh rally routes in Kidong and Suswam. At the scrutineering venue, it was a haven of tough expectations from the drivers. I can tell you it's a rally on rocks. It's driving on rocks, especially the 57 uh, kilometer competitive stage. It's going to be really tough for all of us. It's going to be very technical. Whoever keeps it quick and clean and without breaking the car will have a really good result. Ian Duncan's monster pickup is back and will be among the attractions in the Taditari Guru Nanak rally from tomorrow. Oh! Elsewhere, last year's Boston Marathon champion Carolyn Kilel has won the 10th edition of the 10 kilometer safari com sponsored Kiberigo Road Race in Kisi to also clinch the Golden Series jackpot. In the men's category, two times world junior cross country champion Philip Mosima was upset by Manuel Gaitun, who clocked 30 minutes 19 seconds, while Mosima returned 30 minutes 33 seconds to finish second. Gaitun exhausted a strong field of 56 runners. <laughs> Also, the Guinea's football challenge provided a platform for talent and pride as more than 2,000 participants first off in the competitive challenge at the Nyao Stadium. We're just expecting them to come through, put their best foot forward, and um, for hopefully we get the best representatives to take us through to the end for the Kenyans. The finals of the challenge will put all the best performers from other major towns in the country.